twins die after being found unconscious in a car on I-95. Hello, everybody. I am RJ Smith, and this is Crazy News Reacts. Welcome aboard. Today, I've got a really weird story about a mother who jumped off a bridge after killing her twins. It was around 2 in the morning when there was a 911 call about a vehicle on the I-95 northbound ramp to the Florida Turnpike in 826. These are both very popular highways. The fact that you see a car sitting there like that wouldn't necessarily get your attention down in Miami. But let's go on. Suzette Morant is horrified that these three-year-old twins, a boy and a girl, lost their lives when authorities say they were with this woman, Shirlene Alsim, who Morant and family members say was their mother. To be honest with you, she's a good mother because I know she has an older son. Her older son is about 16 or 18 years old. Morant says Alsim was such a good friend that she even co-signed on a loan for her car. Say what? That's a really good friend. If you can find someone like that who will co-sign for a thirty to $50,000 vehicle for you, that's a friend. She's been a good mother, and that's the only reason why I got her in the car, because I wanted those kids to have get around safe and reliable. Now, somebody I know will do nothing like that. That's impossible for her. She's not that kind of person, so it's just so mind-boggling right now. The female on scene who was the driver of the vehicle uh, she was driving the vehicle where these juveniles were located, and that uh, adult female uh, went over the railing to the on-ramp onto the railroad tracks, which is a considerable distance. Considerable distance, I would say. Now, the big mystery is, did she jump off or was she pushed? Was there perhaps someone else in the car? The mother was rushed to Aventura Hospital. The three-year-old twins did not survive. It's not clear how the twins died. The medical examiner will have to determine the cause of their deaths, as the injuries were not obvious. That's very interesting in itself, right? Don't you guys think? Two babies in their car seats, dead, no physical signs of any trauma, and their mother down on the railroad tracks, deceased. Jeez, sometimes you just don't want to report this stuff, but we got to know. Have a good night. I'll see you right back here tomorrow. I'm R.J. Smith. Thank <laughs> you.